kind of what happened? We lost. We didn't play well. Uh, we'll be back. Um, you guys usually play much better defense than you did today. Or was it? Did they? Did they just get you on your heels, or did you guys just? They got a great flat? point guard, and um, you know we couldn't slow him down. Chris Humphries was hitting a lot of shots. They played very well. You know, it was one of those games that uh, I mean, everybody was expecting a big run from you guys. You guys got a little one, but that big one never, it, it never came to get you guys back in the game. Yeah, yeah. you know, um, I think that we didn't play with a lot of energy tonight. Uh, you know, we just couldn't make a run when we needed it. Yeah, and you, well, you know, you got Monday, you got another chance to, to get out, to get things right with uh, Atlanta coming in. Well, you know, I think that's, that's the great thing about the NBA is, um, you know, a lot of ups and downs, and uh, you know, you just got to come ready to go um, when the ball comes up on Monday. Pips uh, talked, to, as uh, Taj told us, a little bit about pushing it here, like liking where you're at in midway point of the season, pushing it and wanting more. Yeah, I mean, that was a tough loss today. Frustrated with the way I played, but you know, you got to bounce back. So how frustrating is it to stand there and watch Chris Humphreys have the game of his life for the NBA? He's a hell of a player, you know, and he hit a lot of, you know, tough shots. And, um, Fired up. He's had a lot of good games in his career, so I wouldn't say that's the game of his life. But that wise, it wasn't. Still <laughs> career high. <laughs> Joe, given today's game aside, can you just talk about where you guys are halfway through the season and how? Um, we're just not happy with the way we play tonight. Yeah. So, you know, we'll go back to the lab tomorrow and, uh, you know, fix a few things and come ready to go on Monday.